Hello, Monk of the Gamers. Uh, today we're going to be discussing Super Smash Bros for the Wii U. For the Wii U and oh. our predictions for E3 this year. If Nintendo do E3, we're hearing different things. What's yeah. going on? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who knows? My, <laughs> my brain is hurting. But shall we uh, jump straight into Smash Bros? Yes. Okay. So we're basically going to discuss what characters we think are definitely going to be returning. Yes. What characters we want. Yes. What, leaving. Yeah. What characters are going to be leaving? And what characters we think are going to be in, but we don't really, we're not that bad about. No. And also then, you know, stages and any mechanics. Music and, you know, yes, yeah. stuff like that. Yeah. But I think, I think what we should first talk about is the fact that the game might be more competitive as a whole. I hope not. I want it to be, just be fun. It's Smash Bros, just, just make it fun. But they, Nintendo can't ignore, the, and, Na, and Namco, they, they can't ignore the fact that That's the, the game is, it, it is going to be They've either. probably got Namco in their ear. Bit like, I mean, yeah, ha have good online play and things yeah, like that. Yeah, actually, no, that's something that yeah, probably might happen. Hey, I don't yeah. want to be playing Smash Bros again, sorry. <laughs> no, that's true. <laughs> it is not worth it for Smash Bros. But you know what I mean? We might have stuff like block cancels and <laughs> crazy stuff, but who knows? Well, you just have like meter. Ex yeah, I mean, yeah. I don't think they will. That's no, but we'll, but we'll have to okay. see. I mean, I think, I think we should come to the obvious stuff first and the characters that are going to be returning. Okay, so the obvious ones. Oh, right, so the. the Rather than just go through the whole list of which ones we think are going to be, we'll just say which ones from the last game we think are going to be taken out. Yeah. And I think the two definites will be Lucario and Wolf. Yeah. Uh, from previous experience, Mewtwo was taken out, Lucario is put in, so Lucario yeah. will be taken out and the new Pokemon. And you've already got Fox and Falco, so I don't really see why you need Wolf as well. Yeah, so um, I think he's probably going. And the other one that we both thought was Rob. Yeah, I mean, that, that's, going. that's like a maybe. Because I don't think anyone was really that bothered about Rob. Uh, yeah, I mean, I prefer Rob than Jigglypuff, but. <laughs> Yeah, but I think Jigglypuff will probably stay oh, as well. Jigglypuff, he's been since the beginning. I mean, there are a few others that we were kind of umming and ahhing about. We're thinking, would Meta Knight stay? Would King DDD stay? But yeah, we, I think we, they we, make sense. We, we probably think they, they, they will stay. Yeah, I don't think there'll be any more from Kirby, though. Um, mm. But anyway, like, that, as I say, we think what quite like the cast will probably be returning. It's, it's, it's the ones that will be coming in, the ones that we think will be coming in. Okay, so are we going to say which ones we think will be coming in next? Well, let's wait for the ones that I think we want. Yeah, well, so I think should... I think we should mention the fact that obviously it's being in, it's made in, in, in conjunction with Namco Bandai. Yes. So we have, we have to take into account the games that they make because yes, they're so... going to obviously want to add their characters into the universe. Okay, so the biggest one is probably Tekken for most people, but it seems that fits right in with the fact. Yeah. I mean, I think we're going to get the more jokey characters. So Alex, probably Moko Jin. Um, they're the, oh, and, and and the kangaroo. I can't I can't think of the kangaroo's name, but we're probably going to get those kind of characters. I'm not sure we're going to get the. The Zoo years and the Hayaki. So I think like they'll go with some just a normal. Harang or. I think they might go with Jin. Well, he is the main character. Yeah, really. I, don't, I think Hayaki is a bit like kind of, you know, he's popular. I don't, I don't he's just a bit, bit too evil. Yeah, exactly. But it'd be like having a Kuma in. Yeah, well, well, and they, then they just have Ryu. We're not saying that they're going to be in, because Kat can't have him. No. I mean, you never know. I mean, they've, we've, had, we've had Snake and we've had Sonic. That's true. Ryu would make sense, but anyway. Um, we don't think so. So no. yeah, so and also for another uh, there's a few the other Nanko one that we probably mentioned is the Tales of series. Come on! I want okay, this is one I think if they are gonna have anyone from Tales of Series, I actually think it might be the one I want. Lloyd Irving from Tales of Symphonia. Come on Lloyd, he's been on the GameCube. Yeah, so and, and he is the most popular character yeah. from the Tales of Series. Badass. But we're also thinking with Tales of Exilia coming out this year. Yeah. Um, will they character? include a Tales of Exilia character in Fingers crossed. Ah. Who knows? Uh, so there, I think. And the then Pac-Man was the Pac-Man in because that's yeah. Namco. That's I think we, we think that's Namco. We're not completely sure. Yeah. So I actually think the one that's most likely for that is the Tech character and Tales of character. Yeah, just because they're the two, not not too much famous Namco series, but no. they're definitely up there with the Namco series. So yeah. Yeah. Um, okay. Other ones the that other ones that a lot of people have been mentioning, King K. Rule. Yes. That's probably gonna I happen. Want, yeah, I won't mind. I won't mind him. No, I mean, it makes no, sense. Fine. You've got M Mario's, like you know, you've got Barry, uh, Bowser, and Wario. Yeah, and uh, Kirby's got King DDD. Yep. Fox had Wolf. Yep. So it only makes sense that like, everyone has to have a baddie. Yeah. yeah. So we think that's gonna happen. We also perhaps think Samus might get a baddie. Yes. Maybe. We, we hope really, but how would it work? Yeah, we're not really sure. But how do you fit a dragon? Mm. Down to I don't size. really want Dark Samus because it's like kind of like. Oh, I don't know. There's something quite. I, I thought the character was awesome though. Yeah, I just don't know how to make it uh, different enough. Well, say so, that I mean you've had X infect salmon in the Game Boy Advance version. I mean, almost every most games have an evil Samus. You might have one from the um, Metro Prime Hunters because there's loads of like Hunter ones. Yeah. It, uh, you know the character. A space thought, pirate. You know the character I just thought of who probably will be in uh, Smash Bros. with you. Yes. Bowser Jr. Yeah, probably as everyone. Toad. 
Toad. Toad. Yeah, they might be in. Please not Waluigi. Just no. Yeah, no one really likes Waluigi. Waluigi. Crap and not Baby Mario. Baby. Yeah, or, or Paper Mario. Well, we probably will get a Paper Mario. Yeah. I prefer Paper Mario than Waluigi or Baby Mario, but yeah, I'd give it to Toad. I mean, I think. Let me just have a look at our list. Go back to the notes. I think. Oh no. Um, I think of the ov. I think of the obvious ones. Crom from Fire Emblem. Possibly, Fire maybe another Fire, yeah, a Fire Emblem character. Yeah, I think you're gonna have Marth, Ike, and Crom. Oh, there is another obvious one. That's probably Girahim. Yeah, Girahim or Demise from um, Legend of Zelda: Skyward Sword. Because he has to have a buddy. Although obviously he's a bit Ganondorf. Yeah, exactly. But it's, it's possible. I'm just looking at the obvious. Or a pit, a, ba a buddy from the pit series. We yeah. can't think of the we name. Um, but it's going to um, what is his name? Masahiro Sakurai, the one who's making the game. Made the pit one yeah, for 3DS. Um, Kid Icarus Uprising. So, we didn't play it, but I'm sure there'll be a oh, character from that. Another obvious one, there'll be the new Pokemon. Yeah, the, you know, black the, and white. The main one. Yeah. Um, I think, of all the obvious ones, that's probably it. So now we're onto the ones that we actually would like to see. And we'll probably start with the one that's least likely because of the adult nature of the game. Let's play Leon. Leon from S. Kennedy from Resident Evil 4 and 6. Come on. We've, there's a slight bit of hope. He appeared in the GameCube. Yeah. And he appeared in a Wii remake. Yeah, it's just the and fact it, that it's an adult game. It's just whether that will happen. But we can only ever hope. Snake was in. That's true. See, Snake, I mean, Metal Gear is quite an adult game. I find Snake a very odd inclusion. Yeah. But it happens. It's so. because um, Hideo Kojima and Masahiro Sakurai are really good friends. Well, there you go. So... Pat on the back. See, you, 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 a year of mine. Uh, what else have we got? Is Chrono? Oh, Chrono from Chrono Trigger. Please. It's it some, is a classic. That will make some people's day. It will make it my day. Yeah. Uh, what else have we got? Shulk from uh, Oh, Shulk. Of course. Because, of course, the new one is on its way. So it's possible that, you know, usually when you see a pit, when, when the, when the um, Wii version came out, um, Pitt obviously on that was obviously part of the people who played the NES version. Pitt was pretty much unknown. Yeah, but it all was linking towards the new Pitt game it's kind of like, coming oh, out. Oh yeah, I know Pitt, but I don't really know much about it. Exactly, but it was it was all leading towards a game release. Yeah, so exactly. it's, it's, we might be getting characters that are going to be having a new game soon. It's what they did with um, Roy and Martha in, um, um, yeah. in Mali. They, not a lot of people knew about the Fire series over here in like Europe. But then it became bigger and bigger yeah. and bigger, and it worked out really, really well. School Kid from yes. uh, Legend of Zelda. This is one that I, out of the ones we've said so far, this is probably the one I'm most hopeful for. Not the one I want the most, but I yeah. do want him. Yeah. I just, I kind of think that would work really, really well. He's not like an evil, evil character. No. It's to know him. Yeah. But I can imagine him having some really, really cool, screwed up moves. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> what is he going to do? Um, I think the, part of the, the three we've got left, I think one is really obvious. I think a me, a controllable me. Yeah, so you just choose which. All you do is you say, I, I, I want to assign Samus's move set to my me, and then that's pretty much it. One, uh, Professor Layton? I actually think Professor Layton and, and his partner Luke will actually be like. A, a bit like Pokemon with the yeah. Pokemon trainer. Send, um, send Luke out, kid. <laughs> Um, we might have, last of all, Animal Crossing character. Yeah, I don't really know who we'd have. I mean, would Tom Nook, the shopkeeper, really, really work? But oh, yeah. He's, he's kind of like the most well-known character, really. Yeah. Because the, the the person in it, you know, like the person you play, obviously being yourself, is too much like a me, isn't it? Yeah. So maybe they might take that role of the me being Animal Crossing. Possibly. And I think our last one, this is a, Cap this is a Capcom character, so it's maybe not, but there hasn't been this character's game for a while, so we might be seeing it, and that is Mega Man. Yeah. What, what I'm worried about, I'll get this off my chest right now. I never played a Mega Man game. I know, I know, I can hear the screams of people who I'm not bothered about it whatsoever, and I don't want that to be their big release. I know there's some people out there who are desperate for that, but you know, if they had like, when well, Mega Man, they were like, that's the big release. Of but doesn't it make complete sense for the game and the fact that he has different powers, give a me, projectile? Give me Leon, sure, Chrono any day. I and know. School Kid. I know, I just, I just see it happening. But those have been, that, that is pretty much it for characters. So, stages. Okay, Skyward Sword stage. We're gonna get Skyward Sword stage. We'll, we'll get a new Pikmin stage. A uh, Pikmin? Pikmin. Pikmin, Pikmin stage. I'm mean, I mean, actually um, Louis from Pikmin. Might make oh yeah, he might be in there. Yeah. Uh, so we'll, we'll obviously get a I new Pokemon stage. I think there definitely will be a Pikmin stage from the Pikmin three. There's gonna be some kind of level. On oh there. yeah, definitely. Um, I mean, and that is. Well, I mean, there's gonna be loads of new stages, isn't there? Oh yeah, so we're trying to think of. Things that are like yeah. brand new. We'll, we'll probably get a new pit stage, but from from yeah. new characters in the game, I mean, I mean, I could see a zombie one. Zombie for, you. <laughs> yeah, for a, a Leon stage would be awesome. Yeah. For like all the pitfalls of like zombie arms coming up through the ground and stuff. Okay, so do we think there's going to be Smash Balls stuff? Oh, see, the mechanic 
is awesome. Yeah, I think it'll be in. I think it'll probably be in. I wouldn't be. Will Will the idea of me to be in? You know, will you have a special power? Special power is fine, but um, the things that you don't want it like un, you know just limitless. Otherwise, you'd be just spamming. Obviously, I know. Obviously, every character has special powers, but you know, like a meter. So if Samus, if you were charging up the ball and then you added a meter to it, it, it would yeah. make it even more more uh, more powerful. So. I, that, hope, I hope they bring every back fighting uh, game has it. Yeah, I hope they bring back um, trophies, yes. stamp collections, yes, pictures, picture, uh, everything like that. I absolutely love all that. Yeah. All the, unlock the unlockables is the reason why Smash Bros is so good. It makes the game last. It does. I mean, we we uh, like grinding stage, the stage designs, making your yes. own stage. That was oh, that was really awesome. Now actually, with the Wii U, you know, you could be designing it on your, your gamepad. And how's the gamepad? We how got, is the gamepad right. going to work? Because it's going to be. They've already said this. Going to be. Why did we not mention to that? The Wii U. It's going to be on the Wii U and on the 3DS. Yes. Now, does that mean 3DS is going to be able to link up and you're going to be able to use that as Just like another controller. controller? Yeah. Or does it mean there's going to be like a, a game release for both? That's what I think it means. Mm, yeah, we'll have to see for that one. It's going to be pretty cool if like your friend could be on like 3DS like you know next door and they're like online with you on the Wii U. Yeah, see, I mean, I, mean, I, I see that as possible. I mean, although with the gamepad, I could see some kind of manipulation. So if you have friends on classic controllers or Wii remotes, whether the guy with the gamepad could just, you know, send, send a pitfall in or, or send a smash ball in or send, you know, yes. something like that. So I, I don't Hope know. Ball. Yeah, exactly. Uh, yeah. You know how they had, what was it, um, um, what they called, Where, the bonus stages and the mini game. You know, we had to like destroy the targets. Yes, oh yes, I, I oh, you have, like, so a, awesome. Maybe have like a map on there. Yeah. And then also for the mini game, they had like that pinball machine, didn't they? Yeah. Are they are going to make something with the Wii U gamepad? That, yeah, more like that. Yeah. And also, and, and we never know, the story mode on the new Wii U one might yeah, be really good, because I actually love the story mode on the Wii uh, Yeah, I mean, it got, on the, on the Wii it got a bit repetitive, but I like watching all the... Um, yeah, cutscenes cut yeah. and... Yeah. Is there anything else? I'm not sure there is. <laughs> I don't think there is really. Apart from the obvious thing is that it's obviously going to be called Smash Bros. We, you know, universe. Yeah, or something like that. Um, I mean, everyone's guessed that already, but it probably will be called that. I really hope that, like, I know it's not going to happen. I'm just wishful thinking. I really hope at E3 that we get a release date. Yeah. It's not. It's not going to happen, is it? Next gonna... summer. <laughs> yeah. I just hope that they that they're nice at E3. Give us a proper trailer. Don't just give us two seconds of a title. I mean, we were saying before, weren't they? They were nice at the last. The last time they did the trailer for Smash Bros. That was two years Brawl. ago now, yeah. Maybe longer. Yeah, for, for Brawl. Um, yeah, it must, yeah, it must have been longer. Oh, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah for yeah, Brawl, Brawl, yeah. 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 I think they actually showed Wario, Zero Suit Samus, Ike. They showed quite a lot of new characters in the first trailer. So, let's, so let's just pray. Yeah. Pray to those Nintendo gods, people. Yeah. But anyway, that is all Maya we can... Miyamoto is listening. <laughs> yeah. But anyway, that is all we can conjure up about the new Super Smash Bros. So we I've been excited. Yeah, me either. And that was being the Super Smash Bros. Predictions.